Hey, what's going on guys? So I recently went ahead and I removed my 2017 um, stock LED headlights and fog lights from my Jeep because I went ahead and I called Ruby Trucks and purchased a uh, set of JW Speaker J Series headlights and fog lights from them and installed them. The reason why I went ahead and I did it was because I wanted a uh, like a blacked out look for the headlights and the fogs. If it wasn't for that, I probably would have just stuck with the LED headlights. Uh, the LED headlights and fogs that are coming on the 2017 Wranglers were absolutely amazing. I'm being told that, I don't know if, if it's um, like 100% true or not, but some people are saying that they're basically just rebranded JW speaker headlights uh, for Mopar. And I mean, I believe it. These lights are very powerful and I'm doing it, I'm gonna show you right now, I'm gonna compare the JW speaker, the latest JW speaker headlights and fogs versus the OEM uh, headlights and fogs that are LED on the 2017 Wrangler. To be honest, you guys, I couldn't pick between the two as far as which one's brightest. You might notice a little bit of a difference in the color, but other than that, I think they're pretty much um, equal. Uh, let's go ahead and get on with this test. All right, so starting with the fog lights. Right now we only have the fog lights on. On the left side you have the stock LED fog light versus on the right the JW speaker fog light. Um, I'd have to say that on the fog light comparison, the JW speaker definitely wins. All right, so now let's go ahead and move on to the headlight to see uh, which one looks better. All right, so right now with the stock LED headlight again on the left side, JW speaker headlight on the right side. Um, this is where I say on the headlights that they're extremely similar and very hard for me to pick on which one is brighter than the other. Uh, I mean, on the left side, you'll see that the light is like a really pure, strong white. On the right hand side, I would just say that the difference is that there might be like a hint of blue on that LED light but they're both equally bright. I think it was probably just more of a difference in a, like a slight difference in color. Um, I mean, Jeep definitely, that was a huge improvement. Um, it was long overdue. Those halogen headlights that the Jeeps uh, were coming with before are absolute garbage. I mean, these new stock OEM LED headlights from Jeep are a huge improvement. So now the next test is going to be headlights and fog lights, one versus the other. All right, guys, so now we have the stock LED headlight and fog light on on the left side and the JW speaker headlight and fog light on the right side. Again, I see more of a pure white color on the left-hand side. On the right-hand side, I see maybe like a hint of blue in that light, but is one brighter than the other? Uh, I'll let you guys be the judge. I mean, I'd say that they're pretty much equal. Um, to be honest with you, if I would have had a white Jeep, I probably would have just kept my stock uh, headlights. Um, you know, because the stock headlights have that chrome look, so it probably looked a little bit better. Being that I bought the granite crystal, or if I bought like maybe even like a, a black Jeep, or even a silver Jeep, I, I mean, it's, it's up to it's personal preference. It, it depends on the look you're going for. I blacked out a lot of the, thi I, uh, a lot of the uh, things on the front of my Jeep. So that's why I went with the blacked out uh, headlights and fogs. Uh, guys, do me a favor. If you thought this video was helpful, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Give this video a thumbs up. I got a big build planned for this Jeep. Um, parts are on the way. Uh, you know, I got a couple of parts that are going to be taking a little bit longer to ship. But I have a bunch of parts already that are being piled up at the 4x4 shop in Connecticut. And I'll keep, I'm going to be doing weekly video updates, letting you guys, guys know what's going on. And the next video coming out probably uh, by the end of the week, by, well, by the end of this, uh, it'll probably be out by the weekend or Monday, was an off-road trip that I took to Roush Creek in, Roush Creek in Pennsylvania. So uh, make sure you guys are, stay tuned in and have a good day.